All right, folks, back with more Graveyard Keeper. Uh, it is the day of the moon, so we're off to go see the... Finish making that. We're off to go see the astrologer. And... Oh, hey, my iron's done. All right. Um, uh, this stuff's done, too. All right. Yeah, get started making some more. Okay, now we're off to see the astrologer. Give him his human skull. For perfectly legitimate reasons, I'm sure. Which means we gotta trek all the way back to town. Really wish I could get like a horse. Or that the donkey would drive me. That'd be cool. It's actually been a little while since I've gotten a body. Thinking about it. Okay. Yeah, I have the burial certificate. I'll sell that, but we'll go talk to the dude first before he disappears on me. So I don't want that to happen. Seems like a lot of games I've been playing lately have had uh, pretty decent music. Alright, have your skull. Not terribly clean, but every bone is in its place. Seems you have a talent for anatomy. Human body is so mysterious, perhaps even more than the sun and stars. I believe one day you'll learn much about the human body and the soul, and then you will find yourself absolutely lost. Now, as we are partners in crime, what is it you want from me, my curious friend? I need your help. I need to open the portal. A friend told me that you might know how to activate the portal on which hill. I've never heard about it. Maybe not exactly never, but at least not for many years. In another life, I had a friend. By the way, he was a graveyard keeper like you, and he was mad about this portal. It's amazing how much he knew about this portal. Uh, what happened to him? He just disappeared. Hasn't been seen or heard from since. I tried to find him, but nobody knew him. I even started thinking he was just a figment of my imagination. It was a hard time for me. Was his name Jerry? Actually, I don't know his name. I always used to call him by his nickname, Keeper. So what about the portal? I think he found a way to activate it. It was something magical, so I don't remember. Should be in his diary. Just before his disappearance, he gave me this key. It opens a metal gate in the northern part of the church cellar. Somewhere in there is where he kept most of his important notes. Why didn't you take these notes? Well, I tried, but there's a secret to this key. I tried for months to figure out how it works. Maybe it's just in my mind and the key opens nothing. Anyway, you can take it. Try to learn how the key works at the study table in the church cellar. When you have his diary, bring it to me and I'll try to find some information about the portal. Okay. So, I need to go into the cellar and uh, get some flowers. I don't think I need red flowers anymore. Oh, what? Hey, cool. Apples. Can I pick any more? What the hell? Yeah, I don't think I need any more red flowers, but... Oh, wait, wait, wait. We can open up the other side of the graveyard, so perhaps there'll be some more flower beds that we can make. So yeah, I will take these red flowers. After all. Also free up that spot in my inventory. And let's see, before we go back to our humble abode, stop by the inn and uh, sell that burial certificate for some cashola. And, hey, buddy. Okay. Oh, there goes our guy. I think you'll be pleased at the progress we've made. Okay. Let's head on 
back. Goodness, it's already dark. The days go so fast, and there's so much stuff to do. It's a little crazy. That's not done yet, is it? Nope, not done. Um, my iron's done, so that's cool. Yep, store that. Uh, keeper's key, graveyard scroll, right. Gonna need some more stone. Uh, oh yeah, these gravestones. I need to lay them down. Alright, I was not gonna see about some fences. Grave fences. Wooden grave fences. Plank. Can make a couple of those. Make a couple grave fences. Make this place nice. Running a little low after going on my flower bed spree and graveyard grave markers. Uh, examine unlock area. Finally, now I can use the western half of the graveyard. Can I make some more flower beds? Make four more. Look how nice this place is, my guy. Um, Alright, get this out of here. What? I don't want that. That's, that's fucking broken. Alright, put that there. Get it. No, I don't want to fix it. Well, I can't fix it anyway, so it doesn't matter. Uh, there we are. Put something here. All right, seventeen quality, excellent. Um, let's get rid of this shit. I don't know. Uh, hey, buddy, I fixed the graveyard. I was definitely right about you. I need to pronounce you official keeper of this holy place and prior of this church. Let's arrange your first sermon. Ah, it'll be a great honor. So just stand at the pulpit and speak the words. What words? The words! Ha, actually, you can just say whatever you want. You know this place isn't so bad. Put up some extra decorations, some nice candles, music, incense. Get all oiled up for a nice massage. Eh, long story short, all this stuff will help you to get more faith. And faith is power. You unlocked a new technology and got Create Prayer for Faith. A number of very touching words. Your flock will produce more stuff. Park Preacher. Bishop told you that now you can arrange a church service. So there you go. Casual prayer. Okay. Um, don't talk to me. Talk to the people. There aren't any people here. Start praying. Casual prayer. Ten crosses needed for to guarantee successful ceremony. A couple words without any real inspiration. It still works somehow. Church quality 15. Sermon needs 10. Success rate 100%. Craft. Uh. Hmm. Ah. May the forest be with you. Haha, ha, not too bad. My sermons are much better. You should really prepare for your next ceremony. I think the last prior kept some books with some wonderful words in the church library. Probably find some weird stuff in there, too. One of the keepers was engaged in scientific research. Aha, uh -huh, you can throw all that stuff out. Study table, gathering old books, curious mind. You go deeper, find out the essence of things. Studying item has a chance of giving you a story. Spread the word about your next ceremony. Maybe next week someone will show up. By the way, as prior, it's now your duty to perform a weekly ceremony on 
this day. I can sell you some useful accessories for it. Ha ha! So I have a small task for you. Just talk to me when you're ready. Ah, I have to get out of here. The air is so dry, my skin can't take it for long. Okay. So, uh, we got a church now. How about that? Oh, he stairs. Hey, it's that guy again. Damn. Wooden wedges, wooden beam, simple iron parts. Uh, messed up bookcases. Get them out of here. Oh, some books. Some flitches. Where does this go? Won't know for a while. That's for sure. Okay. What is this? Study table. Okay. Instructions. Faith. Science. Huh. That looks a little... Interesting. What is this? Speed potion. We got blood, acceleration powder, chaos solution. What the hell is all this? Increase my speed. Sure. Build a study table. Isn't that what that is? I don't know. I think I'm supposed to go talk to that guy now. What? Where the fuck you go? What the hell? Talk to this. I'm the head of the Royal Treasury Department. We're happy to congratulate you on the reopening of the church and the graveyard. Also, we are pleased to inform you that by using these lands, you've become the subject of royal law. All on-ground structures remain property of the Holy Church. However, all surface land and buildings that sit no deeper than one royal leap and four royal spit, as dictated by the ancient contract, belong to the royal family and the town. Through this mailbox, you may now access a vast array of services provided by the Royal Treasury Department. Your taxes may also be paid by mail. Have a nice day, and remember, King Joe VII loves you. Buying by some exhumation permissions. Uh, citizen. Paid 10 copper to become a citizen. Alright, we're a citizen now. Uh, oh, royal stamp. 50 silver. Yikes. Uh, Building permission. What does that even give me permission to do? Cost 20 silver, whatever it is. Uh, rightful citizen. It cost 30 to become a rightful. Uh, three silver to buy a rightful citizen. Mm -hmm. Rightful citizen papers. Tra tra so basically, as long as we have enough cash, we can just bribe our way up the social ladder. <laughs> uh, ain't that funny? Okay. So that other dude just seems to. Have pieced off, even though he was like, come talk to me, so who knows what the deal with that is. I guess we have to wait an entire another week for him to come back. Uh, oh, my compost finished. Okay. I don't have enough waste to do that. Did my iron? I thought I was making some more iron. Oh, I am now. Uh, let's see here. Uh, I guess I don't need to carry that around. I don't know what the fuck maggots are for. Um, Alright. What is this? Notes. Could be decomposed on the study table to get four blue stuff. Okay. Uh, let's get some more energy. Bat. 
these wings are for. Fuck, hold still. Okay. sign for. My wood stockpile is nice and nice and healthy. Alright, there's more iron. That's good. Uh, you put those in there. Yeah, I don't need to carry those around. I don't need to carry that around. What is this sign? Stone garden. What? River sand. Hmm. Well, when I get some river sand, I'll see what the hell that's all about. What if there's a limit on how much crap I can put in that stockpile? Probably. Um. Oh, hey, flowers. I need red flowers. There's still a couple more. I also need stone. So let's continue. Getting it. What am I doing? I do not know. Getting a mushroom, apparently. I don't think there's anything I'm supposed to be doing today. Need a technology. I don't need a technology, but broken. Okay. Ah, I guess let's go fix it. Hmm. Well, I have enough energy, barely. All right. Time to rest. Let's see. Uh. The merchant comes on that day. Yeah, but we don't have anything to give to the merchant, so what's the point? Not very much. I'm so refreshed. Okay. Uh, oh, we have all this stuff now. Light of faith. Comfort of faith. Just don't have any of this blue shit, though. Oh, we can do this now. Chapter, notes, pigskin, clean paper, ink, story. I see, I see. Insects, I need that. I need some blue shit for that. Um, I can make better tools, complex iron. Uh, let's see. Better mining. Iron ore stockpile. Cooking. Uh, what was I doing? I was getting stone. That's right. My pickaxe. Very untimely. Broke. Can you pick this up? Oh, that gave me a lot of green XP. It's always good. Hey, I wonder where this goes. I never actually went this way. It goes to stone. That's where it goes. Which is exactly what I need, actually. <laughs> That's good. Oh, hey, body. 
Guess we should go take care of that. Before it decomposes. It's... Fix this fence. This fence is kind of, kind of shitty. Oh, hey, he wants to talk. All right. <laughs> Looks like you're doing all right here. Yeah, I just opened the church. So now you own everything here. Yeah, I guess. Congratulations. You're a lucky man. You acquired all this capital for your work for yourself. You're a true capitalist now. This world has no such reward for a hardworking donkey like me. Even you are benefiting from my cheap labor. I feel I cannot call you comrade any longer. Oh no. I won't just lie down and take it. Here's a little present for you. What the fuck? You just shit on my... <clears throat> what? Oh, carrot seeds. Okay. Thanks for the carrot seeds, I guess. Hmm. I can't make those flower beds yet. Okay. Dig, dig, dig. Apparently having an empty grave gives me a minus two. Still a minus two. Okay. Uh, need a technology. No, nope. alright, we can get rid of this shit. Ooh, that's a lot of green XP, alright. Doesn't really give me anything else, but that's kind of worth it. Alright, where are these flower beds going? Right there and right there. So I'm not gonna be able to get rid of that tree yet, but I can get rid of this, I think, yeah. There, now I can put a flower bed there. Kerblam. Okay. How do I chop down these dead trees? Um, do I need that? Like, what fine would work? Um, hmm. like, uh, I don't know, man. Hey, it's that guy again. Able to get four. Only four XP? I don't think I can research anything for four XP. Yeah, everything costs like five. I mean, I guess we may as well do it. Oh, no, it gives me that. Okay. So, oh yeah, all right, okay, so all this stuff says study not complete. The thing, color, next to it. So, let's study this. Uh, it costs faith to do that? Yeah, it costs faith to do that. Alright, what the hell is chaos? Uh, that doesn't cost faith. Alright, let's study that. Do, do. Got a study of chaos solution. And 
Oh, hey, blue XP. Okay, but what the hell does chaos solution do? Uh, don't know. Okay. Um, all of this stuff gives me green. Oh, that gives me blue. Oh, I need that, though. Faith, sure, whatever. Let's get some blue XP. Wow, that was a lot. All right, 25 blue XP, excellent. But so it seems like that just is a way to just poop out some extra XP because that's not really didn't really seem like it did a whole lot for me there. Still salvage some paper from it. How? Oh, all right, but hey, we got our first little bit of blue XP. Um, journalist, you know, little things about people, story, uh, notes, chapters, desk, church, workbench, theology. We can get stone. We can get uh, what's this? Um, comfort of faith. Price of faith. Combo prayer. Okay. Touching story about the church's needs. Earns extra faith and donations. Oh. Uh, create prayer for donations. <laughs> Alright. Uh, cardinal. It's also number of buildings and properties. Your ceremonies give you extra money. Wow. So. Extra cat. Oh, hey, flyers need that. Uh, craft it at desk. So anything else I need to spend blue XP on? Get a woodcutter. Make more firewood and wedges from log chunks. Okay. Sounds pretty good. How about over here? Advanced smelting. Too. So let's see, theology. Uh, yeah, let's get some more church benches. I need some more green XP. Let us clear this out. Excellent. Uh, light of faith. Church quality is a little lacking at five. Ah, oh, shit, I need to make church work bent. Complex iron parts. Okay, uh, smithing. Damn it, I need more green XP to make. Okay. Okay. Mm, it's always something. Get rid of this, then. Complex iron parts. So it looks like I'll need a new pan now. It's okay. Let's head on back.
Mm -hmm. I guess let's remove our old anvil. Of course, it costs energy to remove this. Naturally, naturally. All right, well, uh, it's about 30 minutes, so we'll go ahead and hop in bed and call it an episode. So thank you all for watching, and we'll see you in the next one when we come back with some more Graveyard Keeper, and I'm sure we'll be feeling very... Oh, hey, what's that? Looks like the donkey's back. We'll check that out when we wake up and feel so refreshed. So thank you all for watching, and we'll see you in the next one when we come back with more Graveyard Keeper.